today I will tell how to test your experiments using Sophie UI tool. Before going to this video, if you if you like this video, please subscribe my channel and share this video. Ganga button on it, please please subscribe my channel. Ganga button on it. Okay friends, first we will go to Google and do uh view search the digital file. WS, this is WS file. I don't have WS file, so I will go to the Google and I will pick up one digital file. So, let that is done. So, I will do it. Okay, here you can see this is .NET. So, you can see this global weather search file. This is .NET based, this user is based on .NET. Why? Because here you can see ASMX. So, this is .NET. So, this is so few I think. So, first go to uh, this scope. Click on the scope button. Click on the scope button. You can see here. Project name is there, so digital file is there, so initial digital file. So uh, first copy and uh, paste the digital file. Then copy and paste initial digital. Automatically project name will come. So one second, yes, see, see friends. I will paste only digital. So automatically project name will come. Global weather. Why is that? Here you can see. Here, cross name will come. So please enter the OK button. You can see. Here you can see friends. There two methods are there in user. That is get cities by and twenty and get weather. So these are two methods. And these are two endpoints. That is noun endpoint. And the whole endpoint and the normal endpoint. So we can click the plus button. Okay, friends. They have three endpoints in there mainly. So you can we are using only two endpoints. So click on the plus button, double click. So you can see that this is the raw. So I will give country name India. So. So you can click on this, this button. Subscribe the message. On the content, I will do it. Okay. Here you can see green button is there. Last end of the left button. Submit a request to specify the amount to the URL. So click on this button. So you will see the response. The response will from this website, so you can see it is by country. So, around India, these are states are there. And Hyderabad, 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 I'm saying airport, so Madras. And all these countries are income. So, this is just how you test so QI. So, uh, if you are passing authentication details, like username and the password, you can see left side, which is, you can see from properties. You can give username here, I will give a name and the password, a name. This is authentication detail. So, if you are passing this authentication details in header section, the first properties, I will give, uh, I will submit. If you are passing any authentication, if you are Authentication details here you can pass right click on this so you can see it on second thing. This is how to pass header values. Here you can see add WSS user token. There are two days password text and password digest. Here password text and password digest. Digit. If you are okay. I will give password test. This is your name, password test. So, this will also 
ऑटोमेटिकली एड एर वैल्यूज में एर सेक्शन एड एर सेक्शन ऑटोमेटिकली अनदर वे इज आल्सो बेस्ड ऑन हियर बॉटम बॉटम इंटेंसिटी ऑटेंटिकेशन एंड एड एर एंड अटैचमेंट आर देयर यू कैन सी वन सेकंड हियर एड एर एड एर यू कैन क्लिक प्लस बटन एंड गिव यूजर नेम क्लिक ओके क्लिक ओके एंड यू कैन इज हियर वैल्यू यूजर नेम वैल्यू दिस इज दिस इज हेडर सेक्शन इज मी इट इज पासिंग द वैल्यू टू हेडर सो हेडर इज मच बेटर देन बॉडी फॉर ऑथेंटिकेशन पीपल सो यू कैन गिव पासवर्ड माय नेम इज पासवर्ड सो एनी अटैचमेंट्स आल्सो यू कैन अटैच दिस हेडर सेक्शन सो दिस सो सो यू कैन गिव दिस हेडर not usually had us in this situation we do not any have uh, header section so if you are uh, passing any third jps for p source so right click on show project menu this of the third jps or some uh this of the third jps file to open or something like that so you can keep here and the content um, to um, to Here you can see right click on project. You can see W security configuration and click P store. In the P store, you can pass the uh, JPS to open a special uh, some P store for authentication. So here you can pass the uh, authentication in outgoing. So here I want I have one client of JPS. So click OK button. So here. You can give the client JPS password. So I will give you client JPS password. Just OK. Here you can see OK button. So this is the type of password. So I'm going. I'm going to configure it. Uh, I will give outgoing. Okay, I will give outgoing. Outgoing. Click OK button. Ah, uh, some sample name, unique theme. For outgoing, click OK. In bottom, you can click plus button. So, authentication details will add this outgoing. Okay, here click. There are many ways encryption. Ah, uh, give us your timestamp username. So I will give encryption. Click OK button. This to client dot JPS. This is this to this is only for how to use client dot JPS. Uh, JPS files are open access. This is authentication details. I think you are confusing. So I will give password. Okay, now I think you are. This, uh, all this uh, the features we will add to the request. So I will request. Click on the request. So right click on the click outgoing, apply outgoing. So we can see that key value and the uh, all this will add to the header section. This is okay, friends. If you like this video, please subscribe. and share this video and subscribe my channel okay friends thank you